Alrighty, we have the warp wound back till it is just touching the warp beam. And here's a little hack that I discovered. When you get Christmas wrapping paper, um, if it doesn't have a tube in it, it's going to have a piece of very heavy cardboard that is acting as a tube. And it's going to be wound um, with the last 10 inches, 10 or 12 inches of your wrapping paper. Save that because this makes a great starting uh, warp separator. It's nice and hefty. Um, my uh, warp beam has pretty heavy cords and regular uh, paper. Um, warp separator paper it tends to get torn by it. So I have found that these real heavy cardboard separators that are in wrapping paper um, don't do that as much and it just provides that stability. So I use that for the first wrap. Um, the other thing that I have is because I warp alone I use um, soda bottles or juice bottles, vitamin water bottles, uh, as weights for my warp when I'm beaming on. So those are my little hacks that I use. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel so that you get notification when I release future videos. Thanks and happy weaving.